What's Christmas Eve without recalling a classic poem? This is our take on the night before Christmas. Enjoy. Twas the night before Christmas when all through the house Not a creature was stirring, not even a mouse. The stockings were hung by the chimney with care In hopes that St. Nicholas soon would be there. The children were nestled all snug in their beds While visions of sugar plums danced in their heads And Mama in her kerchief and I in my cap Had just settled our brains for a long winter's nap when out on the lawn there arose such a clatter. I sprang from my bed to see what was the matter. Away to the window, I flew like a flash. Tore open the shutters and threw up the sash. The moon on the breast of the new fallen snow. Gave a luster of midday to objects below. When what to my wondering eyes did appear? But a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. With a little old driver so lively and quick. I knew in a moment it must be St. Nick. More rapid the eagles, his coursers they came. And he whistled and shouted and called them by name. Now Dasher and now Dancer, now Prancer and Vixen. On Comet, on Cupid, on Donner and Blitzen. To the top of the porch, to the top of the wall. Now dash away, dash away, dash away all. As leaves up before the wild hurricane fly. When they meet with an obstacle, mount to the sky. So up to the housetop, the coursers, they flew. With a sleigh full of toys and St. Nicholas too. And then in a twinkling, I heard on the roof. The prancing and pawing of each little hoof. As I drew in my head and was turning around. Down the chimney, St. Nicholas came with a bound. He was dressed all in fur, from his head to his foot. And his clothes were all tarnished with ashes and soot. A bundle of toys he had flung on his back. And he looked like a peddler just opening his pack. His eyes, how they twinkled, his dimples so merry. His cheeks were like roses, his nose like a cherry. His droll little mouth was drawn up like a bow. And the beard on his chin was as white as the snow. The stump of a pipe he held tight in his teeth. And the smoke it encircled his head like a wreath. He had a broad face and a little round belly that shook when he laughed like a bowl full of jelly. He was chubby and plump, a right jolly old elf. And I laughed when I saw him in spite of myself. A wink of his eye and a twist of his head. Soon gave me to know I had nothing to dread. He spoke not a word, but went straight to his work and filled all the stockings, then turned with a jerk. And laying a finger aside of his nose and giving a nod up the chimney he rose. He sprang to his sleigh, to his team gave a whistle and away they all flew like the down of a thistle. But I heard him exclaim ere he drove out of sight. Merry Christmas to all and to all a good night. <laughs> okay, that night before Christmas story, TV magic. But let me tell you, it doesn't always go as planned. So in our next hour over on the Tulsa CW, the blooper reel at 815. Gotta just say, Leanne, the driving force behind that. <laughs> Thank you for doing this every year. It's a treasure. I look forward really to great. it. Well, before we wrap up this hour, Santa, or well, look who is paying us a visit. Oh, yeah. Okay, there we go. And we're tracking the weather conditions for the jolly old man. In our last hour, we had our annual reading of the Night Before Christmas poem from the friends here at News on 6. And the magic of editing makes it look very smooth. But let me tell you, <clears throat> it's not always that smooth. Here are the bloopers. Take a look. I will hunt them down individually to be a part of my poem. My poem. I'll do like a snap over to the camera. Oh, wow. Listen to this. Directing too. I guess. I'm going to try it. We'll see how it looks. With a little old driver and a live. Ah, jeez. <laughs> I gotta find the line. I can't find the line. Okay, that's good. And the. Oh, we're using that one. <laughs> yeah, that's fantastic. Now okay. go away. Total forward and foot. Yeah. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> and you're just giving me blooper material. <laughs> Do you have to do it serious? I'll be here all night. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Mama in her kerchief and I in my hat. Okay, cap. Cap. And mama in her kerchief in my... In it's really funny to sit and watch everybody else screw up. <laughs> <laughs> and then when it's you, it's not that funny. Away to the window. Line, please. Away to the window, I flew like a flash. <laughs> Don't use that one. Oh, yeah, that one's going to be... <laughs> <laughs> 
had just settled our brains for a warm winter's nap. A long, long. Long. <laughs> long winter. A warm winter. <laughs> had just settled our brains for a warm. <clears throat> I just want that winter to be warm. I know, don't we all? I don't want to mess up that gorgeous hair. Oh, you got beautiful hair. Oh. <laughs> but a miniature, but a miniature sleigh and eight tiny reindeer. <laughs> yeah, that was so lively and quick. Gosh, it's funny how fast it leaves the brain. Now, Dasher, now. <laughs> now, Dasher, now, Dancer, now, Prancer and Vixen. Try it again, I was saying something. <laughs> now, Dancer, now, uh, Dasher. <clears throat> oh, and the flick and everything, that was cool. <laughs> His cheeks were like cherries. <laughs> oh, I'm not singing, Leanne. No, I know. Okay, go ahead. Hi, P. Held tight. So up to the house top, the coursers they flew. Oh. And the beauty <laughs> is perfect. <laughs> so up to the coursers. Oh, what? <laughs> Three, two, one. The prancing and pawing of each little hoof. Phil, professional. Move. I know. I, I got the countdown. Three, two, and, everything. and one. <laughs> as I drew in my head and was turning around, as I drew in my head and was turning around. Now turn around. As I was. <laughs> <laughs> See, it's a lot harder no, than no, it looks. Just... Walking and talking. St. Nicholas came with a bound. <laughs> Michael, just go. <laughs> just go. <laughs> Yes, it's a lot of fun uh, doing that, and I enjoyed it. I hope everybody has a fun time doing it and getting them, because a lot of those people are behind the scenes, and they really make our job work. So thank you for sharing, and I hope you enjoyed the, the poem. We're going to give you the real version at the end of this hour, so stick around for that.